Let's see the new array modifier in Blender 5.0. I'm gonna select this object. Now I'm gonna add the array modifier. Make sure to select array and not legacy. We can control it from here, but there's also a gizmo that we can use to control the modifier. We can also randomize the location, rotation, and scale. But the most important is that finally we have a circle array. Just switch to circle. I'm going to increase the radius and modify the count. We can also use the gizmo to modify the count and radius. Now let's say that I want to make copies of this ornament along a curve. Make sure to apply the rotation and scale. Now I need the curve, so I'm gonna select this object and create a loop cut. Select these edges, Shift D to duplicate, then P to separate. Now right click and convert to curve. Now I'm gonna select the ornament and add the array modifier and change to curve. Now select the curve, but I'm gonna rename it and select from the outliner. Now increase the count. As you can see, the array on curve really works now. Um, I can still modify the curve, I can move or extrude vertices. And that's it. See you next time.